There are more than 5,000 children and youth in foster care in Arkansas, but only about 1,600 foster family homes. Court appointed special advocates, also known as CASAs, are a special group of people who speak up for the needs of children who need it the most. In this week's Doing Good Report, we introduce you to a woman who is volunteering her time to make an impact on the life of abused and neglected children right here in Northwest Arkansas. Children without that don't know that their voice will be heard, don't know that their voice matters, don't know that their future matters. After Sarah Allred adopted her son through the foster care system, her heart was set on serving more children in need. There's no way to put it into words really how rewarding it is to be a voice to someone who has no voice. The help her son received from his CASA advocate led Allred to become one herself. The nonprofit is made up of volunteers who walk alongside children in foster care, providing reports to the court that handles their cases. What a CASA advocate can do is really be that one consistent human being in a child's life when they need it the most. That includes anything from a simple phone call to keeping a watchful eye on a child's medical needs and education, ultimately making a recommendation to a judge for permanent placement. One of the struggles that they have is that they're placed in a system that is truly overburdened. Uh, the caseworkers attorneys and judges have way too many folks that they have to try to know what's going on in their lives and making sure they're making good decisions. CASA served more than 800 children in Northwest Arkansas in 2018 alone and it needs volunteers now more than ever. Our wait list right now is 64 children so 64 kids in our four county area Washington, Benton, Madison and Carroll are in need of an advocate. Over 30 hours of training goes into becoming an advocate, but as far as Allred is concerned, all it takes is a desire to make a difference. All you need really is the heart to give, um, caring about these kids, our community, the future of our community. It's really all that's required. The rest comes, just a desire to serve. Every single volunteer helping CASA achieve its goal of serving every child by 2020. It's harrowing to think about what happens to children without advocates because even though there's a lot of adults who care or are involved, whether um, it's caseworkers, um, attorneys, the judge, all of these people are so overworked. All of these people are juggling so many things. And so to have an advocate for a child, you're giving that child a gift. You're giving that child a voice. In Springdale, Kelly O'Neill, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News. And all those volunteers are making such a great difference. The greatest need for volunteers is in Washington and Carroll counties. If you are interested, CASA of Northwest Arkansas holds informational sessions on the third Thursday of every month at 10 a.m. and 6 p.m. at the CASA office in Springdale. You can find that information on our website, nwahomepage.com.